Apocalypse to Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today, I, I hate filming ASMR videos because if you know me, I'm a very loud person. And what sucks is I love ASMR so much, but I can't film them because I'm so loud. But the world is like full of negativity. Shh, oh, that's a lot of wind. I've shut the window, I didn't want to, but I have. So I want to make one of those videos where it's like getting rid of negative energy because I feel like a lot of us need to watch one of those videos and I want to make one myself. And I also threw on my like bohemian style earrings because they make a lot of sound and I think it's relaxing. I actually feel like reading poems. relaxing for people. If you read poems to get rid of negative energy, I aspire to be you because I don't read for shit. So this is Dancing the Dream. This is a book of poems written by Michael Jackson. This is supposed to be more auto autobiographical than Moonwalk. It's just filled with poems written by Michael. And there's like some gorgeous artwork in here, like, okay, so I'm gonna read this one. This one's called Magic. Um, I'm just gonna read this one. My idea of magic doesn't have much to do with stage tricks and illusions. The whole world abounds in magic. When a whale plunges out, like, out of the sea like a newborn mountain, you gasp in ex unexpected delight. What magic? But a toddler who sees his first tadpole flashing in a mud puddle feels the same thrill. Wonder fills his heart, but he has glimpsed for an instant for the playfulness of life. When I see the clouds whisked away from a snow-capped peak, I feel like shouting, Bravo! Nature, best of all magicians, has delivered another thrill. She has exposed the real illusion, our inability to be amazed by her wonders. Every time the sun rises, nature is repeating one command. Behold, her magic is infinitely lavish, and in return we have to do all we have to do is appreciate it. What delight nature must feel when she makes her stars out of, of swirling gas and empty space. She flings them like spangles, a billion reasons for us to awaken in pure joy. When we open our hearts and appreciate all she has given us, nature finds her reward. The sound of applause rolls across the universe and she bows. Okay, so this is a spray called Pillow Mist. Escape and relax. I spray this on my pillow as often as I can, or as often as I remember. Oh, if I could have this as a body spray. My nan gave this to me, like, seven years ago, and I've always treated it with so much respect, even though I've dropped it, like, over 300 times, literally. It's still living. Can you see that through the light? You can. Oh my goodness. Look. Back to the nature thing. Nature is and I planted a little plant last night and I'm supposed to make sure that the soil is firm on top, but it's not. So I'm going to water this. So I'm going to water my plant. Can you see like the water seeping through already? Sage is the best thing to burn when you want to get rid of negative energy. Um, I am always burning sage in my bedroom because um, my friend Mel, 
will confirm that sometimes I have a very strange energy in my bedroom and uh, I don't like it so I always burn sage um, but I bought this from my local emporium which now isn't there I found this out a few days ago that it's not there anymore and that place was my favourite place because they have I'm not flipping you off they have rings like these and I love stuff like that sage smells gross to me at first but since I've been burning a lot to get rid of negative energy. I've started to take a liking to the smell. <laughs> but I do prefer my other incense better. <laughs> Why were you going? My boss gave this to me as a Christmas present. Just a bag of herbs. I don't know what I can do with this. Can I steep this and make tea? I'll have to message her and ask what I can do with this, to be honest, because I know she told me I could do something with it, but I can't remember what. That kind of reminds me of like a relaxing, like, you know, when you go for a walk through like a forest or the woods and like the leaves, like. This one's for Mel because Mel really likes elephants. They're her spirit animal, so. <laughs> These are the rest of my incense, uh, incense sticks, but as you can tell, there's not many left. Oh, it smells so good. Something else I recommend doing to get rid of negative energy is um, this is my jar. I did this when I was feeling really down one night. Um, this is all the good things that have happened to me in 2020 so far. I don't want to read these until the end of 2020, but I'll pick one out just for you. I feel like picking up. I feel like I'm picking our Victor for Hunger Games. <laughs> That's cool. One doesn't count, even though that's a good thing for me. It's not really like personal. Okay. Okay. So this one says I had a makeup project made for me. So a few of my fans got together and they um, they did this huge collaboration of them um, recreating my makeup looks and uploading them to YouTube and then they sent me um, videos of them talking about why they loved me and it was the cutest thing ever. So this video was like inspired by Gracie K and I hope that you are now relaxed. If you're not, I'm sorry I tried but I promise that I will release more interesting videos and I love you.